This is going to be my video review of the Texbo Vintage Simple Cow Leather Durable Laptop Tote Briefcase 15 inch laptop bag. This bag is 15 inches in length, 2.5 inches in width, and 12 inches in height, and weighs a total of 1.2 kilograms. Like all other Texbo bags, this bag is a fairly hefty bag uh, due to the amount of leather that just goes into creating this bag. This bag as its handles, which is something I always tend to focus on a lot on my reviews. Uh, very well made handles here. Uh, they have brass rings on all four sides, held on to a stitched on piece of leather here. And the handles themselves are solid pieces of leather that are folded over and stitched together. The strap on the bag itself is a very, very unique strap here. It is. Um, Kind of like a buckle type of design here let me get that off it's a little bit tight here um, it's a leather strap here with a piece of brass that sticks out a little bit and you just kind of clip it over and hold it in place and it pops in kind of with a satisfying little pop and it doesn't really move around too much but it's just a beautiful touch for people that really love leather and unique designs it's a very uniquely designed strap to get onto this d-ring here and it is just absolutely gorgeous. I love it and I think this is going to be a really unique property of the bag. People who buy this bag probably will be buying it in part because of the strap and the way it's created. The strap itself has um, is held to the back by another piece of leather with a rivet in place that's held in. Um, typically in these bags I don't get a chance to review how well these rivets are held in the place but because of this unique strap here you get an idea of the back side of these rivets. These rivets here are not just to look good. They actually are to go all the way through the leather and hold whatever they're riveted to in place. The strap here, again, like many of the other more modern textbook bags and newer bags have come out, is nylon on the inside that breathes better, absorbs sweat a little bit better, and just overall is a better material for a strap but has this beautiful leather, exact same leather as the outside of the bag, sewn on with a contrast stitching. So you still get the beautiful kind of leather look of the strap with the utility and toughness of more of a nylon strap. The front of this bag here has uh, a large front pocket held on with magnets in place. Uh, it kind of clips on, but you kind of have to move it around a little bit for it to clip um, right into place here because of the way these clips work. Um, the strap in uh, gives you this little tiny front pocket here to throw any extra things that you have lying around that you may have forgotten to put in your bag or you know you're just walking around outside your bags completely zipped up and you need to throw a sheet of paper or receipt whatever it is in here um, front of this is made of the same beautiful leather with the same contrast stitching in place the back of this bag has um, again a zipper pocket um, this is like some of the other zipper pockets in Texbo bags. Uh, it's not quite wide enough for a full A4 sheet of paper to fit in here, but it is large enough for you to throw your important, uh, easy to quick to access pieces like, you know, if you need your wallet or an important piece of paper folded up in here and you can zip it closed and not worry about pit pockets being able to get to it because this side is right against your body. The inside of the bag has one large center compartment. And then it has a little laptop compartment, which I love this little, you know, smart piece of design. It's a leather strap here with the accent stitching onto a Velcro piece that Velcros in place. And it's just beautiful because you open up the inside of this bag and you look inside and you got your laptop here and you just got this nice little beautiful piece of leather holding everything together. And it just looks gorgeous. This is obviously a 15 inch laptop bag, so, or, and will not hold a 17 inch laptop. Inside here, uh, the other two really beautiful touches that I enjoy. Uh, there's these two kind of um, stretchy, I don't know what this material is, but kind of stretches and gives and it's just really, really strong um, with kind of leather accent pieces at the top and bottom. These two pockets that you can fit either a cell phone into or you know whatever else that you need to put a voice recorder a tape recorder and then there's two other leather straps here that can hold your pens and pencils there's um, a very large inside pocket that you can put whatever loose 
things are falling around inside your bag so they aren't you know lost forever at the very bottom like chargers cables whatever else you need this bag overall is an absolutely gorgeous bag um, it's a little bit on the smaller end of a lot of taxbo bags so this is more you know of a messenger bag type of design to be used um, on a daily basis when you don't want a massive huge bag with all these extra pockets you know looking really big and bulky you want something that you can carry maybe a laptop a couple pieces of paper and go to and from work without it being too heavy now uh, this bag would be perfect for that um, this does have a very limited amount of space on the inside so obviously this is not the type of bag that you want to be carrying a huge amount of stuff in if you walk around with a lot of textbooks your computer and you know food and lunch and everything else uh, definitely not going to fit in a bag like this um, other thing about this bag I want uh, leather people to be aware of is that uh, these are not solid pieces of leather on these panels here if you look here these are three separate pieces of leather that are sewn together so there's a single leather accent stripe here but also um, holds the function of holding together two leather square panels and along the back here there is also not a single piece of leather but two small leather squares that are then sewn together the outside of this bag in terms of stitching has beautiful contrast stitching which you're starting to see pop up in a lot of uh, Texbo's products. Um, I really like it. I think it fits with the leather really well. Um, the rest of the leather bag, just because of its professional nature, is not contrast stitched, but actually stitched internally, so I can't really evaluate those stitching without destroying the bag and taking it apart. Uh, this bag, like all other leather Texbo bags, is made of kind of this uh, raw, they call it crazy horse leather. It's a full thickness leather that is absolutely beautiful. However, um, it is a little bit um, raw in its finishing. It's not this kind of shiny finish. It is going to scratch, as you can see, just kind of from my review, has picked up a couple of scratches. And it also needs to be conditioned. If you get it wet, you got to be careful with how you treat this leather. This is, you know actual real leather not you know the plasticized leather that you get on some of the cheaper bags so this will damage if you keep it in a humid place or if you get this wet and don't let it dry appropriately so obviously like all their bags you gotta keep up with the leather keep it conditioned and looks like it's made to last you a lifetime um, this is a absolutely beautiful leather bag from Texbo. Um, a bit of a different take on their typical designs in terms of a little bit of a smaller size, more compact and a little bit more professional. Again, this is the Texbo Vintage Simple Cow Leather Durable Laptop Tote Briefcase 15-inch Laptop Bag.